let me take a sip of my cold water before we get into this story. Oh yeah, this one's uh, this one's gonna be pretty awkward, so get ready. What had happened was, I had brought up to my friend, my roommate, if he wanted to go to an island that is literally across the pier or the harbor in the city of Toronto. So I brought it up uh, to him so we could, you know, maybe go out and do something and hey, we've never done it before. And it was really cheap. It was only about $10 to get on the ferry to get across. So we figured we'd make a day out of it. So he agreed, we got our stuff, and we went out. We went down to the pier, we got on the ferry, and we went right to the island. And I want to just say, it was really nice. You know, just sitting on the ferry, just going across the water. I love it. It's so nice. It's It runs in my blood. I'm not even joking. I, I come from a line of, of fishermen. So, hey. Uh, <laughs> so, we're at the island, and immediately it just feels like we're on some... We're in, like, a totally new place. It feels like you're not in Toronto at all. It's sort of just this forest park area. We wanted to check out the beach. So we walked through the island and we made our way to the beach area. We sat down, we had a drink, but then I noticed that they had bikes for rent. And I looked at my friend and asked if he wanted to rent a bike for an hour. And we ended up getting, you know, those like, uh, those, those like two seater bikes. But yeah, we, I vlogged a bit of it, and we were actually pedaling our way through the roads and enjoying our time. It was really, really nice. Um, there was like white cotton seeds floating in the, in the air. It sounds a little odd, but it was actually incredible. It was a beautiful spot. Now, the thing we didn't know about this island, okay, is that there was a nude beach. That's right, folks. There was a nude beach on this island, and little did we know, we were pedaling in the direction of the nude beach. So we were heading towards the west side of the island, and we, we noticed something a little odd, okay? We noticed that people were becoming less and less clothed, okay? And then, there was a, there was a sign, there was a fork in the road, and one was to go to like some area, but left said optional clothed beach. Optional clothing beach or something like that. And I looked at my friend and <laughs> I don't even know why I said this, but I literally asked, should we go in that direction? I thought it'd be funny. <laughs> I don't know why I said it, okay? Maybe I was hoping that we'd see something, okay? See some, see some, see some hot chicks. I don't know, okay? <laughs> but regardless, we went in that direction. And this is when things get weird. So we were going in that way. And, uh, you know, there was people dressed. And uh, again, it's optional clothing to wear. But then, you know, we uh, noticed this dude just totally naked walking around. So it's like, oh, okay. Uh, all right. Well, you should have ex should have expected that. But whatever. That's fine. I'm not looking, I'm not judging, whatever. We kept going, and there was more naked guys. And more, and more, and more. And then, as we were riding our bike in this area, some dude literally called out to us, and, and he literally sounded like this. He was like, hey boys, the party is in that direction. And I looked at my friend, and I was just like, pedal faster. Regardless, it was pretty awkward, and uh, at the same time, though, we were kind of asking for it because, you know, we we, ch we chose to do it. Hey guys, I hope you did enjoy that animated story. It was animated beautifully by Angel X Mikey. You should totally check his channel out when you get the chance. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for more great content. Alright guys, thank you again so much, and I will see you in the next video.